guys so I'm back with another video and in this video I am really excited because this will be my first time showing and swatching the new L'Oreal Rouge Signature lip collection so I will open the box right now Two, four, six, eight, ten, twelve lip colors here. On the inside, it says, I am worth it, L'Oreal Paris. I love any kind of brand that really helps to encourage, inspire, and empower women. Um, L'Oreal happens to be one of those brands, and I can't be more excited to try these out and swatch them for you guys. I need to. It came with a little pamphlet here. L'Oreal is just super sleek and pro, you know, like very professional and chic in their design and just in their branding in general. So I'm going to read you guys what this says on this. So it says, we invite you to sign your lips in statement color with new L'Oreal Paris Rouge Signature Matte Colored Ink. This ultra comfortable liquid lipstick with a non-drying feel provides a lasting matte finish, a high impact color, and leaves an even stain. It's everything you love about your liquid lipstick. Lasting wear, high pigmentation, and a matte look, but feels as if nothing is on your lips. What could be better? Maybe that it's available in 12 gorgeous shades. Enjoy testing and swatching, and we hope you to see you in, our new, in your new signature look. Um, so that's basically what it says. Now, um, I don't think you can see the detailing of this, but each one has a name, and the names are right here on the sides, or on the bottom of the two. And the first one it says, I enjoy, I rebel, I rule, I create, and so on, and so on, and so on. Okay. So I'm going to go based on lightest shade to darkest shade just because lighter shades are a lot easier to take off as opposed to darker shades and so it just makes sense since I'll be swatching every single one of them. So the first shade we're going to swatch is this one. It looks like a nude color. The packaging is frosty vile here. Everything is all matte except for this part right here. It says L'Oreal Paris on it. I don't know if you can see that, but um, this one is called I Empower, and this is the two, let's see if it's a doe foot, oh, it is a doe foot, but it's one of those um, teardrop doe foots, I don't know if that's the technical term for this, but you know when you get one of these, it's very flexible, and so it's easy to maneuver on your lips. So. Let's try this on. Oh, this is a very peach color. It feels very, very light. So as you can see, because of the applicator, it just goes with the shape of my lip. It really does feel as if I'm just wearing a lip balm as opposed to a liquid lipstick, because you know a lot of liquid lipsticks can tend to get a little thick. Um, this is very, very thin formula, but it still has the pigmentation there. A tea break. The next one is I Create. And this has more of a pink undertone to it. So we'll go ahead and open. Okay. I already love it. I already love it, guys. This feels like I'm applying water on my lips, I'm not gonna lie. 
is exactly how thin it is. I don't want to take this off, I'm not gonna lie. <laughs> I don't want to take it off, it's so pretty. I rule. As girls, we always rule, right? We learned that in grammar school. Oh, okay. This is a dusty pink color. I love dusty pink colors. So as you can see, I'm taking off this color. But because I left it on my lips a little bit longer than the others, it's starting to stain my lips a pink color. I explore. My foundation starts to come off around my lips, and so I just keep a beauty blender at hand. <laughs> I stand. This is more of a taupe colored brown, and I really love taupe colors. I achieve. I represent this color looks bomb look at that oh, my God. oh wow <gasps> what what oh my gosh wow okay so don't mind my really messy <laughs> application. Just look at the color. It's amazing. Oh, okay. Alright, I'm going to wipe this off and it's like not budging. You guys, I'm scared. <laughs> I'm a little scared right now. Oh, oh no. Uh-oh. Oh my god, it does not want to come off. Holy cow. What is happening? Am I trapped in this lip color forever? Like, I feel like a hostage. Oh my goodness. I'm scared. <laughs> I'm seriously trying so hard. That's seriously as good as I can get it. Oh my gosh. Okay. I'm now nah, I'm scared because the rest of the colors are super bright as well. This one is I Rebel. Another bright color. Coming at me right now. Let's see what happens. Well. I don't is the next one. Mm, okay, girl. Okay, I see. I see you, L'Oreal.
very, very snow white lips right here. I am worth it. Whoa. It's like a blood red in color. Enjoy. This is very vampy. Whoa. It's a wine color. I really love berry colors, so I'm really feeling this color right now. Like, really feeling it. Very last color is I Dare. This looks very chocolatey. Okay, I lied. It's not chocolatey espresso. It has a purple undertone to it. It's a very plum, deep plum color. So my overall thoughts on the Rouge Signature L'Oreal I Am Worth It lipstick line is I am highly impressed by this formula. I don't know what's in this formula at all. I really don't. Maybe I should. But I don't know how they got the formula to be so watery thin, yet so pigmented. I don't understand. I'm like mind blown right now. Applying it on my lips was so comfortable. It was so easy. The application of it with the doe foot that they have on these lipsticks, um, it made it so easy to apply the lip color onto my lips because of the shape and the flexibility of the wand. I love the packaging. I love the message behind it. I love that every single one is um, pretty much a declaration, a proclamation of who you are as a woman. And it's really inspiring boldness and confidence and beauty and worth. And that is honestly giving me goosebumps right now just because i love i love 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 anything that has to do with empowering women and i think that if you're gonna wear any kind of lipstick um on your lips or any kind of brand on your face whatever it may be that it should bring out your confidence it should bring out your true beauty and your worth and your value and it should make you feel bold it should make you feel fierce and it should make you feel like you can conquer the day i I don't promote getting all of your confidence from the makeup that you wear at all or anything that you wear but I do think that it is definitely um, something that we as women can actually do to add on to our confidence that day. Um, my confidence comes from the one and only God um, but I love using lip products to really bring forth um, my confidence in my appearance as well. However, I will say one thing. Beware of this color. It's called I Represent. And as y'all saw, I couldn't take the darn thing off my lips. I couldn't, it was like trying to take off a permanent marker. I don't know what kind of radioactive hyperpigmentation they put in this, but I think it needs a little revising. Or maybe it's just meant for the girls who really like bright lips, no matter if they come off or not. I don't know. At least you know, I guess, that your lipstick is going to stay on all day. I'm just, I'm just a little shook. I'm shook. <laughs> like, this thing had me shook <laughs> for a second as I was trying to take it off and it wouldn't come off. I really thought, like, I might have this on my lips forever. 
I might be buried with this lip stain on my lips. Other than that, I have no other complaints about these products. That's it for my swatching slash review. Uh, and yeah, let me know if you have tried any of these lip products. Um, or if you're going to get any of them, let me know as well. And I just would love to hear from you guys. So thank you for watching again. And I will talk to you guys soon. God bless you. I love you. Bye.